Chess friends, how are you? Today I will show you a recent game of Magnus Carlsen which is from Chess.com Champions Chess Tour, and this is your today's workout puzzle, 80 to 90 IQ chess puzzle, solve it and comment me, Wesley so started with e4, Magnus played Sicilian defense, we have knight f3 and knight c6, bishop here and e5 by Magnus, this double island pawns on the center, we engines don't like it, we love to play standard opening of Sicilian, anyway white plays castle, bishop to d6 by Magnus. Blocking his own pawn to develop, however bishop d3 isn't bad but he could play like this, anyway I should not forget that this is an inferior human chess game, d4 by inferior human, sacrificing his own pawn, knight takes and takes, Magnus wins a pawn but this pawn structure can be attacked by c3, and f4, ok, c3, bishop here, b4 and bishop back, a4, threatening to play a5, so we do see here a6, bishop backs, knight to f6, Magnus can strike the center with e5. After takes the queen will arrive on there to neutralize his pawns, a5 by Wesley so, bishop backs and b5, pawn takes, taking the pawn with bishop is little bad, because the bishop will not create any problems for black, it is worthless to put the bishop on there, black will play normally, and he will get some extra time to activate his pieces, so knight here to target this stupid pawn, Magnus wins a pawn as a tempo, knight takes, now the pawn will die with the knight's hand. And if you try to save the pawn by playing bishop to d4, let me show you the variation, try to protect it then he will give a knight check, king slides, queen ups and threatening mate in one with the supporting of the knight, so queen here, knight backs to target the queen, and in this position, no matter where the queen will go, position will be a dead loss for you, let me show you the variations one by one, if queen to c5 happen then bishop will come to a3 to pin the queen to the king, so. Back to the position, if you move back your queen, then bishop a3 check, king slides to g8, knight check, and after some moves later, the knight turned into a nightmare to kill all of your pieces, position will be a dead lost, so, in this position, if you play queen e6, then bishop will give his check anyway, here and check, and the knight will destroy you, the king is in middle of the board, and it will be plus 9 position for white, so, back to the position, we have bishop to c5. Try to cover the diagonal from any future attacks, bishop here, Magnus played castle, knight takes and h6, bishop takes and queen takes, now the position is completely different, he want to put his knight on there where Magnus have d6, and queen here and g5 moves, knight d5, queen back to d8, queen here, d6, rook to b1, a7 king slides bishop e6 bishop here and queen to h4, targeting to the h and e pawn, with the supporting of bishop, so f3, rook goes to a8, rook a2 and queen back to d8 targeting this pawn with three rook batteries, we see h3 rook takes, rook takes b7, rook takes, bishop takes, queen up to h4, threatening to take the pawn with the bishop, let me show you the variation, if you play rook back to b1 to give support to the king, then black will play bishop takes h3, sacrificing his own bishop to expose the king, after takes and queen takes check, he will block it with the queen and then queen takes, blocks and queen check, here, then he will take the queen, king takes, rook takes bishop check, and these pawns are enough to win the game, so. Back to the position, Wesley is a stockfish subscriber too, he calculates all of these moves and played king h2, Magnus played king h7, rook back to b2, rook to a3, threatening to take the pawn with the rook, let me show you the variation, if you play normal move like rook b1, then will sacrifice his rook, so after pawn takes rook, queen takes check, ops, it's turned out into a check, ha ha ha, game will be over so back to the position, if you play bishop to b3, try to block the rook's rank. Then bishop, d4 to target this rook, we will see rook back to b1, then bishop takes rook, sacrificing the bishop, after pawn takes, bishop f2, threatening queen check, king back to h1, then it will be a checkmate by playing queen takes h3, so, here you have to play king g2, queen check king backs and queen check, king here, takes takes and takes, position is critical because rook is coming to destroy your queen, if the queen runs with the knight, then queen will arrive on there to mate you in 7 moves, so. 
Back to the position, we do see here rook to b3, Magnus played rook back to a7, which is a mistake move because he missed a winning idea, let me show you, there is bishop takes pawn, zocking the bishop again, the rook is hanging, the bishop the hanging, if you play rook takes rook then bishop, back to e6, which is called checkmate with the savage bishop, so, in this position, if you take the bishop with your pawn, then bishop will come to support the queen to come and deliver checkmate to the king. King slides then queen check and backs check and here, and there is an absolute savage move with queen and bishop, bishop to e1, going into a lion's cave to steal a piece of meat, if you play queen takes e1, then rook takes a2 check, the king have to run away from this rank, after king here, queen takes queen, and black will win the queen, so, in this position, best move is to play rook takes a3, queen check, king here then takes, game will be over for you, so, back to the position, Magnus missed bishop takes h3. And played rook to a7, because he is not as strong as my alpha zero subscriber, and chess friends, if you want to be smart in chess, then you can like and subscribe to my youtube channel to get more episodes, rook to b1, bishop to f2, threatening queen check, here, then bishop takes pawn, so rook f1, now the queen check is worthless because if it happen, then king backs, bishop takes pawn is bad because of rook takes, this is protected by this. So, back to the position, we have bishop check here, backs, queen here, threatening the rook and the queen at the same time. So Magnus have to take it. Wish you all the best, thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.